Actually, uh, hard luck for Qatar team and uh, what, uh, victory for Ecuador. Uh, I think Qatar will gonna make a good uh, will gonna make a good uh, game in the next uh, game because this was not unfair. I think because because if you see the Qatari uh, players, they're not uh, like um, they're not uh, they're confused. Yeah, they're not that much because if you see in the World Cup of Asia. Yeah, they made many different uh, achievements and they got the, the, the cup. They know how to play. The, the, the man who teach him, yeah, the trainer is so perfect. He, he knows like how to train, how to make tec uh, techniques. Uh, I really believe they will gonna like go to the finals. May God bless them. Wow. And uh, Portugal. Why? For Ronaldo, I like Ronaldo. He's a very good man and uh, uh, he supports Palestine. It's, uh, it can't I can't describe this feeling, you know, there's so many festivals, uh, all the countries are participating, even the countries that are not in the groups, they are participating. It's a very nice event. Like, I would all people uh, advise them to come here to see the World Cup, to see the festivals in all the world, Kurnish, uh, Sudwakif, uh, also Mshereb, so many cultures and arts, you know, so many good things. Of course I watched the game, uh, they, ha they, did, they did a good match. Ecuador, it's, uh, you know, they have much better players, but for them it's a good experience. They, they are not experienced in World Cup, neither my country also, but we still have hope. Uh, we are supporting everyone, uh, like I support Argentina, Brazil, like England also, I love England, but I'll stick for Morocco for the moment till the next turn. <laughs> oh, really I want to see Messi, maybe, Cristiano, uh, you know, Hakimi, uh, Ziyech also, uh, uh, who, like uh, Kane, are Kane is in the World Cup also? Yeah, okay. Kane also, uh, a lot of players, you know, I'm watching the Champions League, all the, the leagues in the world. I'm very happy, like I'd be so proud if I meet some players outside for so, because I work at the airport, I see them all the days, but I can't take photos, you know. <laughs> and Ziyech wasn't allowed to play for Morocco until recently, how happy are you that he's back in the side? Well, of course, Ziyech is a good player, he will add something to the, to the, uh, to, to the team. Uh, we're very happy to have him, also Hamdallah, we're very happy to have this kind of players in Morocco. We have our hopes. Like we may qualify, we have some, we have support and everything. You can see it's already crazy outside. Moroccans are making it crazy. So like this is a special edition. We are welcoming all the world in here, and we are very very happy to see you guys in Qatar. And last question: Who's going to win the World Cup? Mor Morocco, my friend. Of course, I'm going to say Morocco, but I'm still sick for maybe England, maybe France, maybe Brazil. You know, you will never know. You will never like know. England. Yeah, it's a surprise. It's a surprise. Thank you, bye. Well, uh, thank you today, but this is a special opportunity. It's a beautiful country. Everybody is welcome in here. I work in Qatar. This is my first experience. I've been here for three months now, and it's very crazy outside. You can see the supporters all over. I'm from Morocco, and I hope the best my country to at least qualify the first round. And do you think the rest of the world has the wrong idea about Qatar, and it's going to be good to see it in, in this light? No, no, listen to me, brother. It's a beautiful country. People are very nice. They are welcoming. There is no problems in here. Uh, like you can see the atmosphere already. Uh, Qatar is very happy to, to, to have this first edition in, in, in the Middle East, and it's an Arab country that are, that is organizing the World Cup. Uh, for us, it's a uh, uh, you know words I cannot tell about it. You will sh you will see. You will go to stadiums. You will see the atmosphere and everything. You guys are welcome. You guys are welcome. Don't worry. It's oh. great. It's amazing. It's the first time a Muslim country, an Arab country, has a head of the World Cup. You can see the environment. People were talking a lot of stuff about Qatar. We're, we love this place. We love different people, different cultures. It's all, it's all about diversity, guys. We support diversity. No religion doesn't matter. Your, your, your skin of your, your skin color doesn't matter. Do you think some of the criticism is unfair about this World Cup? 100%. 100%, yeah. I mean, why? I mean, you gotta respect the culture. We're Muslims. If we come to your land, we're gonna respect you guys. We're gonna respect your cultures. You, we expect the same from you guys. We're not gonna change our religion or culture for 28 days. So we're not gonna do that. When we come to you guys, we're gonna respect you, we're gonna support your culture, and we're gonna do according to your law. When someone comes to our home, we expect them to do the same thing.
Hundred percent, yeah. I mean, if I do anything, you can go to the fan zone. If you want to drink, go to the fan zone. It's not a problem here. Yeah. We're not close-minded people. If you want to do it, go ahead, do it. But yeah. in these public places, we don't want any drugs here. We just want to have a good time, sober people, enjoy. Because it's a family, it's a family-loving country here. People, you can see there are families here with the kids. You know, we don't want to bring our kids to people who are drunk over there. You know, because kids have a bad impact on drunk people. It's a place for it's a, it's a place for families, and everybody can come here. And all the religion, religion, families, all people of any age can come here. That's the best part of this world. I want to be one of the best tournaments in the history of football. We spend the most money in the history of football. So you can see we've got a lot of uh, concerts, a lot of DJs, a lot of artists are coming in, a lot of festivals, a lot of new beaches. It's a new thing, man. Just join us and you're going to have fun. Messi is the greatest player in the history of football, hands down. Mic drop. And is this going to be his tournament? 100%. 100%. So you think There's he's no going to bow out with the World Cup? doesn't matter. Messi is going to win this World Cup. And he's going to end the conversation between the GOAT. Ronaldo, Messi. Come <laughs> here,